there shall come a star out of Jacob, and a scepter shall rise out of Israel. This scepter is a chosen generation, a royal priesthood, and a holy nation. They are called by him, by Yeshua, out of darkness and into light. These same were in time past not a people, but become a people of God. This is to say they are not a national or an ethnic group, such as the traditional Israel. These sons and daughters of the carpenter are a nation of priests. The authors of the Dead Sea Scrolls that were found in Nag Hammadi in Egypt in, I think, 1947, the Essenes, the authors of the Dead Sea Scrolls, the Essenes of Qumran, well, they were Kabbalistic astronomer priests. And that is essentially what the Bible is all about. The Bible is a highly symbolic tome of knowledge, an eldritch tome of knowledge composed by Kabbalistic astronomer, astronomer priests that was meant to encapsulate, to preserve knowledge of a from a golden age that was to keep this knowledge intact, to make it through the Kale Yuga, the Dark Age, the Age of Iron, the Piscean Age, into the Age of Aquarius, where those with knowledge, those with gnosis, would be able to interpret the knowledge from the Golden Age, the Satyuga, while in the depth of the Kale Yuga, to birth the new Kale, the new Satyuga. But this knowledge begins with your own sustenance, your own self-empowerment, infusing your soul and your life with the same God force energy that Yeshua had. Without needing to change churches or even be a member of any particular church or organization at all, unless you choose to be. But this knowledge, this God force energy, is not meant to be kept within, hidden. Once you experience it, you must share it with the world, with your world. If it entails you going into a church and doing spiritual warfare with those still caught up in the external symbols of Jesus, of all the biblical figures which are symbolic, they are formula for each of us to experience, to work through, and ultimately exploit, make use of in our own path of ascension. The bread of the soul. Bread is the food of the soul. Bread is your gnosis, is the knowledge, arcane wisdom. That is what the Bible is all about. Come, and I will make you fishers of men. That is, creators of a new world with a new sun and a new age. You must open the womb of the earth that we may father each of us, that we may birth a new humanity with sacred knowledge as our genesis, as our fuel, as our God force energy that will give birth to this new earth. And so mote it be. Namaste. Namaskaram.